Om Shanti, welcome back. We are here with 5th of October's Holy Blessing. Now, how do we become full of all attainments so that we feel that we have experiencing or we have reached completion? And this is what we are going to understand in today's blessing. Here, Supreme Father says, May you be an embodiment of attainments. And those attainments come only when we have certain discipline, when we are following certain rules and regulations. And then we realize, yes, the life which we were living and the life which we are living now, there is a vast difference. And Right now, we are living a proper spiritual life. Now, especially people think that spiritual life means that you have to wear some kind of saffron clothes or white clothes and that's how you become spiritual or that's how the world perceives you to be spiritual. But that's not the truth. What we are from within and not what we are from outside, that means our behavior, our character, our thoughts, our words, our actions define us more than anything else which people perceive from outside. So the attainments of spirituality are discipline, character, bliss, happiness, joy, love, independence, good nature, mercifulness, obedience and so many different qualities are there which are imbibed by a spiritual person. But if it's not there, that means we are not yet spiritual. So God says, may you be an embodiment of attainments and experience completion by becoming full of all the treasures. Now what are those treasures which you're going to share over here? When it is full moon, God is giving an example, <clears throat> that fullness is a sign of its completion. For it will not grow any bigger than that. That means it's complete. Its fullness is that much. There would no be no more growth. In the same way, when your children are full of knowledge, divine knowledge about the self, full knowledge about the self, yoga, that means connection with God, dharna, that means imbibing the knowledge and imbibing good behavior, good character, good virtues, good values. And then with those virtues, those values serving others, that is when you are full of all treasures. As simple as that. This fullness is called completion, just like a full moon. Because such full souls are embodiments of attainment, they are also constantly close in their stage. Close in this stage, in their stage means reaching perfection. And close to godly character, godly nature, godly behavior, godliness within them. That means divinity within them. And that is only possible when we are doing four things. That is what has been explained. Knowledge. Yoga means meditation, connection with God, meditating on God. Dharna, imbibing his qualities, his virtues, his knowledge and also serving other human beings. This pack of four makes us complete. It's like four legs of a chair, four legs of a table. And this is what is important in the spiritual journey which we are doing in Brahma Kumaris to learn about this knowledge, yoga, dharana and seva. Yoga is not a physical yoga by the way. It's a mental spiritual yoga. You are most welcome to attend a seven day course at Brahma Kumaris. I'm shanti with this.